I want to remind you today that your life matters. So hear me loud and clear. Your life truly matters. And I want to talk today about how you can live from this place where your life truly matters because that's what you need in order to feel that somebody else's life truly matters and that everybody's life truly matters. And that together we can create this most wondrous human experience with nature on planet Earth. But it begins with you feeling and you knowing that your life truly matters. I'm Anna Gatman and wherever you're watching this, this is coming to you from the Expansive with Anna Gatman YouTube channel. So I just finished teaching the Expansive Path course, part one. Um, the second half of this uh, workshop was this past weekend. And we had a wonderful time. It was very intimate and profound and deep, the entire course that we did. And this past weekend, I facilitated a guided exercise, which I call, Are You Worthy? And so I usually take participants through two types of questions and sentences. Some have to do with feeling lost and forsaken and not feeling worthy and feeling broken. And then other questions and statements have to do with feeling precious and feeling whole and feeling part of something larger and seeing the miraculous life that you have on this planet and the possibility. And so something beautiful came up for one of the participants. They said, my life matters and therefore your life matters. And so that's what I want to tell you today, that your life matters. But you see, if you don't feel that your life matters, then you're not going to feel that somebody else's life matters. Because whatever you deny in yourself, you deny for others. Whatever you reject within yourself, you reject when you see it, when it appears in others. Whatever you judge in yourself, you end up judging in others. Whatever you choke and you strangle or you starve within yourself, within your full potential, you choke and strangle and starve in others. And so you might feel that you feel worthy of this wondrous, miraculous life in certain areas or at certain times. And then you have parts of you that don't feel that you are worthy. And maybe you're just living by the rules and hoping to just get by. And so you don't truly believe that you have the birthright and that humanity has the birthright to live in personal freedom, in planetary peace, in creative collaboration, and in stewardship of our precious planet Earth. And so in order to feel that somebody else's life matters, you need to first feel that your life matters. And so just like the instructions on an airplane is to put the oxygen mask on yourself before you help somebody else, a child or an elderly, likewise here, you need to feel that your life matters in order for you to feel that all life is sacred. The life of the plants, of animals, of human beings, of all race and ethnicity and gender and everyone, everyone's life matters. And so I invite you to explore those dark corners in your heart, in your soul, where you don't feel worthy, where you've denied yourself something, where you have rejected a part of yourself because of personal history, traumas, abuse, cultural norms, societal norms, your family, education system. There's so much to stop us from living the full potential that we each can live. But now as you're watching this, this is the moment. This is the moment that we've been waiting for and where you have this opportunity at every moment right now to look at where you don't feel worthy, where you don't feel worthy to live the full, beautiful possibility of bringing the heavens down to earth. And as you do this inventory and you see what you have re repressed 
and what you have choked and what you have denied, you will be able to accept it in others and wish for it in others and have compassion for others because you would have released it in yourself and brought it into the light. So this is really a time for you to go inwards to see the richness of the possibility. And so take some time for yourself, sit quietly and ask yourself or journal, am I worthy for those deepest longings that I have? those dreams and aspirations that I have? Can I make them possible? Is this the time for it? And then see what's stopping you. What are you denying? What are you starving? What are you judging? What are you rejecting? And as you bring it into your life and into the light and own it as part of your true heritage and what you want to bring into the world as your gifts and your talents, you will be able to feel that your life matters and therefore everybody's life matters. So wherever you're watching this, leave me a comment. Remember, this is the moment for you to feel that your life truly matters. Blessings.